hope. Oh, here we go. Uh, Ingor. Ingor. Let me touch your chest slightly. Wait, what? Huh? Is that it? Uh. Wait. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> come on. That's it. Well, at least they tied up all the plot threads. <laughs> yeah, of course they did. Like, what the fuck just happened? Hope they was. <laughs> they didn't get to that one, but they covered up all the other plot threads. So why didn't we just lose to Luda? Because he was a dickhead, and that's that. All right, principle uh, thing. Okay. Yay. Aww. I guess. Your rod and staff comfort me. Thank you. Go to church, oh, everyone. God, that was bland. Yeah, yeah that was something. It's great. All right. Now for my favorite part, the reviews. Um. Can I? Uh, does anybody want to start us off? Because I can. I, I'm gonna go piss. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Am I not supposed to say that on his? No. Hey, office? I don't give a shit. All right, I'll be back in a minute. I'm no, that's probably one of the reviews, actually. <laughs> I'm, I'm, oh yeah, yeah, I'm sorry. That was actually page eight. My bad. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks. On page uh, 47, GB389. Awesome. Well, I hear, I mean, read a lot of people saying this game. It's really, really hard. But I'd like to give you guys the walkthrough. But I don't have the time. But I can tell you this: turn quality to low. Then there's like two blank lines. Anyways, rock end game. Five <laughs> out of five. Just seeing a lot of interviews giving unnecessary praise on the game, which makes me more sad than wanting to read them. I'll, I'll go with, on uh, page I, eighty. Though there is one who gave it a perfect rating. Amazing! It was really good. I just can't figure it out. Maybe a walkthrough. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go to page uh, forty-seven again. Blood when you it. piss is normal once in a while, right? Yeah. Yeah, that's okay. fine. All right. All right. I, 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 I like. I like it. Oh, actually, no. Um, no, sorry. Page 46 uh, from Alpha Rhino. These scores need to go to 11. Uh, <laughs> this is an amazing and well-thought-out game. The secrets are perfect. The fighting is great. Even the voice acting is spectacular. Honestly, this game should be looked to as an example of what an adventure game style, an adventure style flash should be. It's just amazing. You get a 10 in humor because I carried that duck around the first time into my epic end battle. Bravo. Is he talking about the Phoenix? I think he is, yeah. Okay. <laughs> I hope so. <laughs> the anyway. epic duck. <laughs> uh, somebody wrote up a serious review. What page? Oh. 11. A serious review? Yeah, it's oh like, god. Yeah, it's is, long, dude. That first one? <laughs> yeah. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want by yeah, N20K. That's, that's what grabbed my attention, but uh Holy shit. This is serious, but he's like, uh it's too difficult. I love a good challenge now and then, but damn, having a time limit to reach your objective is all right. I know it used to be like 30 days and you extended to 50, but fighting bosses and enemies are still a huge pain. Yes. Uh we call it um, like the music from Pursuit and Mayor Dan McNeely. By the way, what's with him anyway? <laughs> well, now this is most fortuitous. Who the hell speaks like that? Apparently, Mayor McNeely. So he just answered his own question. Yeah. Hey, uh, <laughs> uh, the end is good though. Uh, overall, Zombie Inglor is presented well. It has great <laughs> art, a decent voice acting. Mm -hmm. Some voices sound like they're from a machine, and overall, a great look. Mm -hmm. But the gameplay is too hard and leaves me frustrated to the point where I don't want to play anymore. It's decent, 7 out of 10. People found that helpful. <laughs> yeah, they did. Somehow. Oh, on page 3, Death Guy 90 says, hmm. Oh, hell yes. Minus Death one star for the fact that you can't win the second shooting challenge. Minus the next star because of the disaster boss. Other than that, great game. 4 out of 5. Wait, now that doesn't... Wait. Wait. <laughs> One minus no. <laughs> uh, carry the four. He didn't read the math book and the A plus X four yeah, book in the game. A plus X four. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going on page nine with Qu Quagland three thousand who says, uh, <laughs> "One liners, good game. <laughs> five, out of, <laughs> five out of five. He just I've... snorted some coke before. <laughs> Uh, on page 15, we have Pyramid Head 666. Who, oh, I already know this is going to be great without <laughs> seeing it. <laughs> it's just a, a emoticon <laughs> with big ass eyes. This is great game! 10 10! Exclamation. <laughs> I wish. How, how do I pronounce 15 exclamation points? I don't know. Uh, 
I don't know I, how much I, emphasis <laughs> to give. Ten out of ten. <laughs> I don't know how much emphasis to give really on that. <laughs> on page five, uh, Revoth makes makes you think. Awesome game. Mysterious ending. Was he cured or not? No. Was he cured <laughs> or not? Is apparently the title of the sequel to this game. As well. <laughs> Five out of five. <laughs> uh, how, do I, how do I kill the kid with the shield? I mean, killed the other kid, but how do you kill the kid with the shield that wants the treasure? That's a good review. Three and a half out of five. <laughs> make, um, make the okay. bosses less harder. From from <laughs> Fukyu Biatch 88. Oh, good one. Um, zzz, shit, I fell asleep. Five out of five! <laughs> Newgrounds does not have much of a um, consistency uh, cur- level curation. Yeah, well, yeah. no way. Ro- uh, uh, oh wait, one page twenty six. <laughs> Rockin one nine nine one nine nine seven one says, "I thought it was really hard to beat the game with only fifty days nights. I died like every time. Other than that, good game. Nice music." Hmm. <laughs> then a little plug for the website. Yeah, you know the music pretty much wasn't it all ripped from his earlier trilogy, and yeah, actually. wasn't even really that memorable there. <laughs> On page seven, annoying fights. This game is lagging like my grandma. <laughs> <laughs> Two stars. <laughs> like the next review is four and a half stars from Gold Fifty Four, but the first line is good enough to play. <laughs> it's like the bare minimum of a video game. Oh, it's very helpful for me to know this is good enough to play. It's good. Let me I mean, just you know. mark that. Oh, okay. Page seventy-one. All right. Please. Colonel Archer says. Wow, dude, I love this game a lot. I've never seen anything like it on Newgrounds. I got pretty far in the game. I have one problem. I had to wait for day 28 for Miss Old Cunt to come and give me the bread. <laughs> what the hell is up with that? I spent a good 45 minutes playing this, and because some haggity ratty cunt bag doesn't show up, my 45 minutes are wasted. Maybe you could tell me when the fuck that dumb old ratty ratless rat who has no rats comes. Jesus hell. <laughs> Honestly, douche, you're a queer giraffe. Maybe someone could give me the actual date and or time the old shit appears at the fountains. I guess since I love the game a lot, I must finish it. Four and a half out of five. This is a great game, you queer giraffe. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> um, <laughs> I saw one before I was looking at <laughs> From the Forgotten One on page 68. Um, my copy can't handle it. I put it at the lowest graphical setting, and I can't beat the first boss because my computer's too slow to handle it. That four-day pe- penalty for death is really harsh, by the way. I wish I could beat it to see the ending. But three and a half out of five, so... Yeah, I don't see many low scores on this game, to be honest. Oh, you can sort by rating. It was oh, a daily second place for when it came oh, out. Oh, shit. Well, yep. let's Like, go. Uh, the lowest rating from Rob Mortar on page 82, sorted by rating... Uh, dude, it's too hard. It won't even let me kill those two fags in the cave. Zero out of five. <laughs> okay, well, on 81 by rating, Wes277 points out aptly, a zombie with a gun, dot, dot, dot. One out of five for that, huh? Yep. I'm also uh, sorting by reviews and going by page one, looking at the people who loved it. <laughs> uh, one guy says, Excellent. This game is really one of the best game in Newgrounds, but it will just better if the day system change. <laughs> I could not agree more. Well, people found that helpful. I mean, it is very oh, helpful. Oh, they did dude. find it helpful. Wow. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Um, Husker on page, uh, I think, 80, sort of by rating. Um, da, 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 da. This game is lame. I gave it two stars because I felt kind of bad giving it a zero. Uh- one star. One, one star. <laughs> Maybe he averaged the two. Right, right. <laughs> I also like U- Uzumaki320, who's like, God, make the bosses less harder. <laughs> no, that's not how. This guy on page, let's see, page two sorting by rating is apparently arguing with somebody on the latter pages of sorting by rating. Because he says, cool game, 
to the guy below me, dude, the guy put a lot of work into this. Even the crappiest games even take time and patience to make. <laughs> now, the author of this game spent weeks, even months, trying to make a game just for our pleasure. No one made him do it, at least as far as I'm concerned. And yet, look at the way you thank him if you got Flash and created a game that took months of painstaking work and submitted it to Newgrounds. And one guy just said the very thing you said, I bet you'd be very sad and or angry and probably respond with a load of swears. Oh, Sorry God. about that, but awesome game. I love, quote, zombie killing games. I, Devious I wanna, face. I just want to point out, too, the guy being like, you know, oh, if someone else did that, you'd be really upset. His name is Commando Kill. <laughs> like, you'd think he'd probably a little, you know, more hard-hearted. And, the, and then um, <laughs> Doom Man 12 on that same page below. Uh, the hell, use a walkthrough. Use a walk throw starter. Yes. <laughs> five out of five. <laughs> then a couple up from that. Incredible. This game is awesome, though it glitched once when I was in the cave where you get the she isled, so I had to start all over, which was agree vating, because it took me forever the first time to beat the boss, who is name I cannot remember at the moment. Keep up the good work and definitely make a sequel. <laughs> oh, DJ Deadman666. This one's pretty good. I regular 91. Uh, it's sort by pay or sort by reviews, page 73. Okay. <sighs> gone to waste. I accidentally switched page and all my progress is gone. Six out of ten. <laughs> I've just I just read that one and I'm just like, what? <laughs> <laughs> page three sorting by review. O M F G. I was polaying this game all day. Oh God! <laughs> five out Polaying. of five. Five stars. Oh, darkest lover. Most of them just say it's too hard. Uh, what do you call it. <laughs> I like this one from Jackie Head. By the way, on the same page, uh, R O T F L. This is just rolling on the floor laughing. I had to write this review before I even finished playing. The game brought back to life <laughs> all the things about the Trap series. Um, period. So I guess it just brought up everything. And B BTW, I love how Diala says, I will have to continue to pursue my investigation. Hint, hint, awesome game. Did the guy know, did Jackie know which game she was reviewing, though? <laughs> yeah, which game was that? Yeah, right? what game was that? This is Zombie Inglor, still, but... But were they reviewing, like, Trapped? I I don't know, because of the review. Yeah, it sounded like they were. <laughs> Oh, and look, there's another one of these on page 7, if you sort by rating, by Xvagos X. Great game, good game, good storyline, and good voice acting. I got questions that needed to be answered. Why is Diala in this flash? She is from Pursuit and Escape, and there's, like, hyphens around them, right? Nah. What is her role in this? McNeely? Is he the Dan McNeely from <laughs> all caps, Trapped, Pursuit, and Escape? <laughs> What happened to Inglor? Tell me. Pursuit is a scat-themed hunting game. <laughs> uh, page 60, 69. Nice. Nice. On rating? Yeah. Right. Flaming, Flaming Dookie has a, uh, has a review for us. <laughs> Meh. Graphics. Gets a zero. No way to turn them down. And on a shitty computer like the one I'm running right now, the battle with Eric lags. Yeah, I want to turn these graphics down. <laughs> He says there's style. I have a feeling I've played other games like this. Sound. A bunch of the NPCs have voices, so eh, ten. Okay. <laughs> that's violence. New, classic Newgrounds right there. Viol <laughs> violence, which is new to me that that's a category in a ranking system, but uh, hardly any violence. Just kidding. Ten. <laughs> Interactivity, standard point-and-click interface, humor, eh. <laughs> Interactivity, oh, no score given. Yeah, no <laughs> score given. No, none for humor either. But overall, seven. Humor, humor gets an eh out of ten. Yeah. Eh. <laughs> All right, I I cannot stand the review right below that by Shroom Picker. <clears throat> Skippies, listen very carefully. Oh games, God, yeah, I just saw this one. Games with ten times this complexity played on twenty five megahertz processor, sixteen meg of memory without a problem. But this game completely overtaxes my one point four gigahertz Intel processor with seven sixty eight gigabytes of memory. Yeah, whoa, 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 slow down. Repeat that part. 
this game completely overtaxes my 1.4 gigahertz Intel processor. Okay, okay, and? With 768 gigabytes of memory. Okay, now, let me All stop right. you here. Oh, wow. wow. My computer has eight, uh, six. Yeah. Six gigabytes of RAM. Get with the times, Proteus. When was this review written? <laughs> 2007. <laughs> you know, when RAM was really cheap. Proteus, you need to get something more than like a 30 year old computer by now. Come God, on. God damn, I knew I shouldn't have bought this Tandy. <laughs> okay, uh, anyway, you can keep reading. I just had to point out the 768 gigabytes of memory. <laughs> God, his computer has a 1.4 gigahertz Intel processor with 768 gigs of RAM and a Motorola 1.2 gigahertz processor also with 768 gig of memory. Yes, when I combine does. my super machines. I, when, I, when I get my 1.5 terabytes of RAM. I move the gun to shoot a zombie. Five seconds later, it's there. One, two, three, four, five. Can I move the mouse yet? Will clicking work or will clicking happen another five seconds later? Oh, fuck you. I hate this guy already. I hate people who pretend to fucking know how to... Oh, right. God, yeah. I didn't read the second paragraph. Did, did you use busy walls while programming busy this? Busy weights. Busy weights. Oh, excuse mm -hmm. me. Busy weights while programming this. Did you... Uh, you always use an event queue system or event heap stuff, system for stuff like this. Every bullet action, oh god, push it to the heap and resolve it when the present time comes. Oh, I want to stab this fucking First I, I, of all, can you even socket into my face. Uh, can you even control the heap in Flash, for starters? No! Like, can you even do that? Like, can you push stuff onto the stack manually in it's Flash? Not, uh, this is this was AS2, which I think, uh, no. You can't do anything in it. You had a, it was a GUI with, like, a fucking timeline thing. That's pretty much what I figured. I figured it was, like, Premiere, except you made video games in it. I mean, like, I, I'm not seeing push into the stack and shit. I mean, I know you got to script some, but... Yeah, I'm not, no, I'm not seeing memory management being a big issue in fucking... I, 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 yeah, no. I don't think you even can in, like, Action Script 3 where it is, like, its own whatever. Jesus Christ. I, it kills me. Are you using busy weights? See, like, the author's gonna be like, wait a minute, busy, this guy knows what he's talking about. He's got 768 gigs of RAM. He, he, does, have a, he does have a lot of gigs of RAM. You gotta yeah, give no. him some credit. Absolutely. He actually needs RAM to page through his RAM is the thing. <laughs> for it. He sets a few... A few yeah, uh, uh, he sets about 16 gigabytes aside as like a, a fourth level cache, and you know, he really like kind of does some amazing architectural stuff. That's why he can talk about the busy weights like that. It's a it's a it's a pyramid scheme of of RAM is the thing. <laughs> cache, RAM. cache is all the way down, baby. It's actually slower than his hard drive now, but you know, still it's a lot it's got of a, fucking It's RAM. got a page like 450 <laughs> times to actually access anything. <laughs> Oh shit! Oh uh, god! Oh, programming that's, humor's the best. That's why we brought you on. No, uh, I don't you. know what you guys are talking about. It doesn't matter. We barely do either. <laughs> we do know that busy weights are are something that he should have used. And uh, <laughs> what a fucking fool! Oh fuck me! Alrighty, do you guys have any others you want to bring up, or you think we can call it? Not really. In fact, this page won't even load, so I'm going to call it. All right. Well, uh, thanks for coming back and doing zombie Inglor with us. Hey, no problem. Let me it end was, it on just I, one I'd, more. I'd say it was great, but it, it wasn't great. <laughs> <laughs> all right, you want to end it on one last New Grants classic review? Just Go to kind of sum it all up, on page eleven, sorting by review. Mm -hmm. Can't figure out game. How do I get double pistols? I can't kill Ludi. How do I get dragon? The game was great overall, five stars. <laughs> I think that sums it up. That it pretty sums much sums it up, it up yeah. right there.